The statement of hydrostatic law is the rate of increase of pressure in vertically downward direction is equal to the specific weight of the fluid at that point. Now for that we have considered one tank having one liquid. Now as per this law, the pressure at the bottom end is more as compared to the pressure at the top end. So for that we have provided three orifices and if I open this three orifices that is three holes then the fluid will come out from this uh, tank and you can imagine how the fluid will come out so the fluid will come out like this so bottom is strongest jet and top one is weaker jet that indicates that at this section pressure is very high as compared to the pressure at this section so that is nothing but hydrostatic law in order to do the derivation let us consider a cylindrical fluid element like this having a cross section area is dA and height is dz let us consider pressure on the top side of this fluid element is P and pressure on the bottom side we can find out by using the Taylor series so that is P plus dou P by dou Z into dz this is the pressure on the bottom side then we will try to find out the forces we know that pressure is force upon area so we can find out force as pressure into area so force on the top side we can find out as pressure into area area is da force on the bottom side is p plus dou p by dou z into dz into da so force on the bottom side is this pressure into cross section area that is ta so these are the forces pressure forces now we can consider the weight of the fluid element weight will act from a cg in vertically downward direction and weight is nothing but m into g so this thing we can write as rho into volume into g volume of this fluid element is a da into dz into acceleration due to gravity so these are the forces acting on this fluid element under equilibrium condition we can write summation of vertical forces is equal to zero the speed da force will act in downward direction so it is minus so minus p into da then this bottom force will act in upward direction so it is positive p plus dou p by dou z into dz into da and weight will act in vertical downward direction so it is negative so minus rho into da into dz into g that is equal to zero same equation we can write in this way We can cancel out the terms like this and this will cancel out. So we can write this equation as dou P by dou Z into DZ into DA that is equal to rho DA DZ into G. DA DZ DA DZ we can cancel out. So ultimately we are getting uh, the equation as dou P by dou Z that is equal to rho in. That is uh, the rate of increase of pressure in vertical downward direction that is dou P by dou Z that is equal to the specific weight that is nothing but rho g at that point now uh, we can write this equation in this way like dou p is equal to rho g into dou z and we can integrate this after integration we are getting like p is equal to rho g z so this is nothing but hydrostatic law